Mm -hmm. And we're here. Hi, everybody. How you doing? We are live. Welcome to the uh, show, the channel, the reality, the uh, the mystic, <laughs> the fun times, uh, the craziness, the wildness, the uh, the greed, the the, the X factor. Uh, welcome, one and all, to the show. I'm glad you're here. I'm just reading your comments here, just as I was coming on noticing how you guys are commenting to each other what kind of options you're playing and what's going on i love it it's exciting cheers to all of you around the world tell me where are you watching me from where are you watching me from today what what city or town are you in i have no idea where you people are i love it i'm in palm desert california which is right next to rancho mirage which is right next to cathedral city which is right next to palm spring going the other way i'm beside indian wells and la quinta and um uh, Indio and Bermuda Dunes and uh, uh, all kinds of little areas. Um, tell me where you're from. Uh, here's here's um, London, Texas, Chicago. You think you see what I'm, what I'm talking about? We're from around the world. L.A. County, sunny day in Toronto, Dallas. Uh, show what's that? Sholo, Arizona, Alberta, oil burn as we call it. Uh, thank you, everybody for saying hi. Where are you at? Gross Point, Michigan. Apple Valley sends greetings. Yes, Apple Valley. I love it. Sweden is here. Miami is here. Look who's here. They're everywhere. I'm telling you, the, the folks who watch this channel, Alabama. I love Alabama. Auckland, New Zealand. You got to love this. Uh, thank you all. Connecticut. I say again, your mom's house. <clears throat> Arizona, North Carolina. Dumpy Western. Uh, <laughs> says that was about you. <clears throat> oh my gosh, <clears throat> got me. What are we going to do here? I'm from the land of Bales and Prophets, Chicago, Austria, San, whatever, uh, Santan Valley, Arizona, uh, Atlanta, and credit for Severus. Anyone else loaded up on MTTR $20 January 22 contracts during this dip? I got me five when it hit 1820. Uh, interesting. Well, MTTR 1859 a share. It's popping back up again. Uh, Fabulous. Calgary, Alberta. Great town. Um, San Francisco. I'm from San Francisco. Did you drove or did you flew? I love it. Uh, that's an old line from SCTV. Manchester, UK is here. Shout out from LA, California. Atlanta's here. Um, I'm in Palm Desert. The chat is coming from inside the gun. No, no. Uh, Pasadena's here. Uh, Robert Lee, that might be the best part of my day. Um, 601 Lexington Avenue, New York, New York. <laughs> I'm from the UK. I'm from Ottawa, Ontario, Canada. Welcome, one. Welcome, all. Have you been watching the markets? Of course you have. We've been all watching the markets. I'm noticing uh, Rocket Lab down 22 cents right now, $13 a share. The uh, stock uh, uh, has been as low as 12.73. That was first thing this morning. Uh, reached 13.22 about an hour or so ago, and it's now 13 bucks. Still down 22 cents. Um, so it kind of broke even there for a bit, or almost, not quite, on a million shares. Uh, so far, 19.42 down 53 cents. Uh, this is kind of the low range. Uh, we opened it with a bang. We went right up to 20.48 right away. Uh, I had a viewer tell me they wrote a call option today on SoFi. Uh, I'm not sure how many others did this morning. Uh, the shares have backed off since, unfortunately. We're 1944 down 54 cents. I don't know why. 13 million shares. I don't know why it's down here, uh, but it is. GameStop is down 449 a share to 173.35. I know a bunch of you have been writing options on GameStop, and uh, some of you have already started buying back. I think, Rob, you mentioned that you bought back those uh, calls that you rolled over the other day, I think you rolled over from 170 70 to 175, and you've bought them back already at a, at a nice little uh, pullback. Nicely done. Uh, and you're getting ready to write another set of calls. You're just waiting for the stock to tell you what to do, when to do it. That's how you do it, buddy. Well done. Um, Matterport, 1856 down 40 cents. was as low as uh, 1813 today. Now 1856. Um, we'll see if that keeps coming up. 1.8 million volume. 23 and me, 1224 right now, uh, just at the high, right now, 1226. That is the high of the day right now, up 32 cents on 2.8 million shares. The ME shares at 1030 this morning were 1159. We're now 1226 and climbing on 23 and me. Aspire, 607. Since I left you, uh, the shares are in around the five, six dollar mark, was six, five ninety nine, six bucks. They got up to 623. They got slammed. Came back up a bit, got slammed again, came up a bit. We're now at 6.08, up 19 cents on the day. 1.7 million shares traded. 
and there is a battle going on for supremacy on Spire. There's absolutely a battle starting to pick up here. What is happening? What's going on so far? We don't know. Winnipeg is in the house. San Pedro's here. Calgary is here. Uncle Bruce, leave the gun. Bring the cannolis. Uh, Going to have lows of minus 12 degrees Celsius this weekend. Oh, Brian, that's not good. That's not fun. I'm not coming to your house. Nick, I, Uncle Bruce, I am the leaning. As I am learning this option trading, I wanted to play safe, so I bought to close 10 for a buck sixty, and with that profit, I bought a thousand ATP. Did I do it right? Yes, you did. You did it right. You sold, I believe, ten GameStop contracts this morning at four ninety-five. You bought them back for a buck sixty, clearing thirty-three hundred and fifty dollars on ten contract. Now, lovely, and now you picked up a thousand ATIP, uh, scoring the cheap stock. This is this is sweet. That is a beautiful move. I love it. That's a that's a great day trade for an, for a call writer. That, that is a great move. Uh, Tori, I was down about four hundred yesterday. I'm back up eighty bucks today. Uh, number thirty eight thumbs ups for Uncle B is where I'm at. Says Nick. Right on, Nick. Thank you for throwing the thumbs up out there too. Tesla is at thousand forty two. Says Kiwi. J G. Hey Uncle B. So what kind of so buy options should we be writing? Um, the shares get into that twenty dollar level. You want to write 21s, maybe 22s, two, three, four weeks out, something like that. Try to bring in a buck, buck 25. Stock backs off a little bit. They come down to 50 cents, buy them back, uh, comes back up again to a buck, buck 25, a little high. Write them again, backs off a little, buy them back. Uh, something like that might be the plan. Moving on to some other stocks, we got ME at 12.24, Spire down 6.03, ATIP 2.75 down 13 cents, Smart Rent 12.99. It's hit a high of 13.04 today. We're up 96 cents on 323,000. Goldman Sachs did put a buy a buy recommendation on this stock today, 18 bucks a share. Absolutely 18 dollars. Looking a very that looks really good. That sounds beautiful. Um, smart rent has been higher than this. Uh, this is not its all time high or anything like that. Um, the shares uh, have hit a high of 15, 14. Um, they're now at 13. It's nice to see uh, this happening. We're going to have their financials on November the 10th, so that's a couple weeks less than less than two weeks from now. Uh, but uh, uh, this is a nice recovery from the little dip we had, what was it, yesterday, 11.49, 11, 11.49 a share, was it yesterday, or last week maybe, last week, 11.49, uh, beautiful little pop up here, um, very happy to see this, um, but I'm not surprised, uh, uh, Smart Rent can move like this on its own, but uh, getting another buy recommendation with a senior house, at 18 bucks, yeah, that looks pretty good. <clears throat> uh, six Terra, eight nine dollars eighty one cents, up eighteen cents. Uh, this is the week on Six Terra. It's just up, up, up in the last week. No news, no one's talking. Everything is quiet. Hundred sixty two thousand shares traded. That's it. No volume, and something's cooking. I, I just, I just like I've said before, um, on other stocks when they go really quiet and they start to inch higher every day something's up i don't know what it is uh let's see what's going on um let's see what else um uh, i don't dylan i don't understand what you're asking me here bruce what does it look like on a stock chart if someone places a large order then calls the broker and asks to cancel it was a mistake uh usually the charts are corrected uh hi everybody larry how you doing buddy um uh sharon hi bruce it's all it's about 60 degrees right now in central new jersey uh, and we're between storm systems right now. Oh my gosh! Um, and uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, I see. Chris Savage. Uh, someone messed up and said SoFi sold 100 million worth of SoFi, or SoftBank sold 100 million worth of SoFi. SoftBank is a big institutional investor, so people thought it was a bad news. It was wrong news. Bad intelligence. Yeah, th th those get. It won't make a difference. Emmy making a strong end of the day run here. Afternoon, everybody from Goody Goody. Is that pronounced like Coyote? Uh, credit service. I love writing SoFi covered calls. Usually, I wait for a five cent pop or more, and once I see a dip, I sell covered calls near the money, and they always retrace back down. John uh, Bickman, uh, what triggers do, do you guys look at deciding to close call options? I have Spire seven fifties for uh, February. <clears throat> now, are you are you uh, you have written those? I'm assuming you're long those. 
um, uh, you want to hang on and enjoy the show here. Uh, 606 on the stock, up 17 cents today. ME 1221, up 27 cents. All right, Rob, I just bought some more CYXT, um, 1250 calls for January 22 for 35 cents, bringing my... Uh, my average down to 55 cents. I need a bit of a kick in the stock now. Come on, baby. Uh, yeah, six there, 982 up 19 cents. So uh, we all are looking for something there. Six there is just up because I chose to take a bet on Spire instead of purchasing the other weeks. So she says, my fault. John, is it a percentage gain or or the Greeks? Um, not sure what that means. Uh, yeah, it's like coyote uh, and a a guy. You know, coyote. Like that's that's how I do it. Brumbler, hello everybody. Socius, hello fellow simpletons. Uh, Benneville, uh, Socius, hello simpleton. How have you been? Hope all is green. Welcome, Benneville. Um, Evan Thumbs, hit the like button for Bruce. Thank you, everybody. Appreciate that. Uh, and uh, people tend to to be quiet because they're working. That's probably why certain stocks are quiet. Uh, heads down, thumbs up. So uh, there you go. Uh, let's see what happens. The Dow is down 139. Low of the day, kind of right now. We're down. Four and a half on S&P, probably the low of the day. NASDAQ up 74 points, which is the opposite direction of the rest of the market. Oil down two bucks to 82.64. Uh, like I say, we're still negative on Rocket Lab at 12.99. SoFi down 55 to 19.40. GameStop off 4.59 to 173.25. Matterport down 44 cents. <clears throat> ME is up 27 cents to 12.21. It's going to go higher. Spire 605. It looks like it wants to go higher. Up 16 cents. <clears throat> ATIP down 12.9 cents. Smart Rent up 96 cents to 12.99 a share. That will go higher. Sextera 982 up 19 cents. AMC down a buck 26. Robinhood down 4. 11 to 35.46. Vanek Vectors down only 75 cents. Home Depot ups 3.76 to 3.72.96. IBM down two bucks to 125. Frustrating. Down at 157 on the Dow. Microsoft up $14 a share now at $324. New all time highs. Apple down a dime. Tesla up 16.60. Bed Bath Beyond down 48 cents. Blackberry down 22. Royal Caribbean down 49 cents to 83.93. The economic realities are setting it setting in for Royal Caribbean and Norwegian and Carnival. Carnival. Uh, Goldman down 5.92. Amazon up 29.90, Facebook got down to 167. Google is up $168 a share to 29.61. Google up $168 a share today to $2961. Uh, they are rocking because they are cr cramming in the money. They're just closing it. I am making them them rich with all the YouTube followers I have. They own YouTube. I, I'm helping YouTube become a much more wealthy channel. Look at what I'm doing helping Google today up 160 bucks. You're all welcome. All of you who have Google shares, all of you who have pension funds that have Google shares, all of you who have uh, 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 hedge funds and, and mutual funds, you're all you're welcome. It's a courtesy of Uncle Bruce. It, it was no trouble whatsoever. I just talk all day. That's all I do. It's, it's easy. It's all I do. I just tell people how to, how to get richer and that's all I do, uh, and, and it's it's working for Google. Um, Target down 176, JP Morgan down 343, Costco up five bucks, Walmart down 80 cents, Cisco up 64 cents to 56.45. Cisco is coming back to 60. Uh, have you noticed that out there, folks? It's looking good. Uh, Apple is approaching 150 again. That's looking good too. Um, there you have it. That's kind of where we're at right here, watching this market. Smart Rent 12.99 up 96 cents. Um, Spire up 12 cents to 602. Me 12.15 up 21 cents. And uh, some of you are having fun writing options today, and I am thrilled for you on this. Uh, uh, let's see. Hello from Winnipeg. Great show, says Palant. Thanks, Palant. Uh, thank you for, for being here today. Um, and uh, let's see. What else is going on? Uh, let's see. Uncle Bruce, uh, I just got call, uh, all nostalgic. Uncle Bruce, can you comment on IRNT? I don't know what that is. Uh, I'm from Ottawa as well, says Trish to this. <clears throat> got options op op a few weeks ago. It's popping. Uh, I just got finished. Uh, uh, Decker for Halloween. Uh, let's see. Um, uh, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, Sean and Wendy are saying are asking. Uh, we do not follow it, but <clears throat> for education purposes, uh, only IPO aired today 
it was negative. Only IPO irritated was negative. Their, their rent clothes did not depreciate the clothes in their IPOs. What is this? Can you explain, please? I don't know anything about it. Um, don't know. I don't follow these guys. Don't I can't. I, I have no idea what's going on. Um, it's a win-win whenever it gets rich. Exactly. Uh, exactly. Uh, sounds like creative financing. It you could well be. Uh, it could well be. Uh, thank you, everybody who who are here today. Thank you, guys. Uh, those of you who are members, you know what you mean to me. You are the backbone of this channel. Please consider becoming a member of this channel if you're not one already. Join in the fun here. Uh, join us for commentary during these market trading hours. Um, thank you again, all of you who uh, who uh, uh, you know made it a mission to become a member and stay a member of this channel. I love you guys for this. Uh, it means the world to Jennifer and I. We appreciate it so much. It's the reason we're able to be here and stay away from that cold, ugly winter up north for now. And we love you. We're going to go members only chat now. Uh, thank you, all the rest of you who are here. Please consider becoming a subscriber if you're not a subscriber already. And tell your friends that we have a really cool site here. Uh, get them to join us. And uh, hopefully, the kind of content we bring you can help you and your fellow relatives and friends and neighbors and whatever get rich too and uh, join join the channel and join the gang uh, whenever you can love to have you come on board absolutely fantastic thank you all of you so much for uh, for being here i love it um let's see here we're going over to uh there's that there's the thing oh yeah here we go we've got uh we got 130 thumbs up so we got um, ritish patel thank you ritish patel for joining as a member man i love it it's great that you're doing that. Uh, if you're a recurring member, uh, welcome back. If you're new, welcome to the gang. I love it. Uh, SoFi New Low, 1931. That is a bargoon. Beach Boy, hi, Uncle Bruce. Uh, while I wait for those GameStop November 22nd, when it is to shrink. Shrinkage, uh, do you have any plans for more classes? <laughs> Example, the mental side of investing. Uh, I have been uh, uh, looking at ideas to produce produce more classes uh, we've got 10 up now on the website uh, many of you know these you know about the classes a number of you watch them from time to time I know that some of you seem to watch a class once a week uh, some of you watch one or two a week uh, there are 10 of them there now all about option writing and that type of thing and I am thinking of producing new classes I am um, I haven't yet decided when and exactly which topics, uh, but um, trust me on this one. Uh, the minute I decide I'm going to do additional classes, I will give you guys warning. Uh, members will be warned first, as I always uh, reserve the uh, info for members. Members will be told that uh, there was a, there's classes coming, and you'll be offered an opportunity to reserve a slot to join me for the live presentation of the class um, <clears throat> ahead of everybody else who's not a member. Uh, once we have uh, done that for a few days, we open the, the classroom up if there are slots still available for anyone else who would like to come into the class and join us live. Uh, then we do the class uh, on the set day, um, and then I get the class edited and upload it onto the website uh, within the week, and then anyone can watch it anytime they want thereafter. So those of you who are uh, um, you know, interested in, in my classes being live participants, which a number of you are, uh, stand by, and as soon as I'm ready, I will let you know. Um, I don't have a class set at the moment, but yeah, it's, it's under construction, and uh, we'll keep you posted. I had to get this wedding out of the way. We had to get back, and uh, we gotta just, settle in and figure it out so stand by folks and thank you so much uh beach boy thank you uh my my, my best advice uh, sean Wayne, just stay away from ipos absolutely stay away uh ratish thanks again ratish ratish patel thank you man uh I, I, I'm, I'm glad you're here um and uh let's see um yeah i wish youtube would allow the option to gift a month sub to somebody uh, that would be cool. I, I wish they did too. I, I really do. Uh, but um, it's YouTube that controls the membership situation and how it works. And I, you know, uh, I can't do anything about it. There's nothing I can do. Uh, so, yeah. I suppose I can see how that can be man manipulated. That, that yeah, th there you go. Um, good one, Gaiotti. You, you've answered your own question, perhaps, why this doesn't happen. Fred, good afternoon. Can someone tell me what level writing options is on Fidelity? I currently have level two. Does anyone know the answer to that? 
Welcome to Ritish. Fred, uh, writing is level one. Uh, level one for writing covered calls. Thank you, says Fred. Uh, we have thumbs up for Bruce. Uh, B fits. Uh, Bruce, I don't uh, I don't uh, know about this bleed on SoFi. If it continues to fall, I feel like securing the remaining profits now and rolling out to later dates. Do you think it's better to just hold? I, I would hang on, just don't not do anything. The stock can pop up three, four bucks in one day. Um, I don't understand why the shares are, are coming into any resistance. Uh, uh, there is so much news coming. There's so much, so much in development. But you know the markets are the markets, and sometimes they do stupid things, and you got to take advantage of stupid things. Uh, of course, have you considered uh, Udemy for additional exposure? Udemy. I have no idea what that is. I have no idea. Uh, Sean, a rent the runway had shady um, accounting in their IPO today. CBC's reporting just wanted to know if it was negative for that industry. Not a fan. Yeah, I I, I hate that stuff. Good stuff, says Beachway. Thanks, buddy. Fred, I have 300 shares of Soul Plane. I was thinking about writing covered calls, but I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> getting back I'm, uh, getting back until SoFi year and more of it lowers closer to 18. Um, Fred, SoFi. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Uh, I'm holding, um, Gaudi says, I'm holding SoFi until the bank charter, uh, but my cost basis is down around 15, so it's not like it's hard to hold at the moment at all. Just ride them into the sunsets, associates. Paul says 15, that's nice. Uh, yeah, I'm with you, Gaudi, on this one. 1581 through, not not far off. I flipped near 20, says Paul, uh, 21. Uh, Fenville, Fred, uh, B, now is not the time to sell covered call on SoFi. Uh, drop. I got a fourteen seventeen average on SoFi. Uh, Credit Savage, Uncle Bruce. When are you going to meet with folks here in California? What's the plan? Hotel, salon, suite. Should we bring pen and paper? Laugh out loud. No plan yet. Uh, just a lot of thought, a lot of scheming, a lot of wondering, kind of thinking about it. Uh, we got homework to do. Jen and I have a lot of figuring out to do here, including uh, a where, when how what and just like you're asking me um it's all in here with the classes and uh, exposing the channel to more people and uh, there's a million things going on here uh and one guy doing it i'll keep you posted we're down 205 on the dow we're down 13 on s p we're up 33 on nasdaq the markets are definitely going negative right now we do have earnings coming out later today and tomorrow and next week uh, lots coming but at the moment, we're underwater a bit right now. A profit taking, maybe it's about time. The markets have had a good run lately. Um, Coyote, Fred, I would wait on writing covered calls at the current price. I plan to write covered calls at 2120 if the bank charter has been announced. I sure hope uh, anyone made money on this wacky DWAC. Stay away from that stuff. Fanville, usually you write covered calls on stock pops and buy it back when it dips. Richard, thanks, Uncle Bruce. I made my first thousand today from your advice. Thanks a lot, buddy. Thank you. Um, Stick around and enjoy the fun. Let's keep going. Uh, we're not done yet, Coyote. But I know people like Chris Everett is pretty good at writing cover calls at this price on SoFi. GameStop, new low. Um, ca nice cashing checks. It's fun. I've been buying options on Spire, 750 February. Oh, doing okay here. British uh, uh, shilling, Coyote. Best that can be is to give someone a gift card, and that can be used for any membership. But no, you cannot give someone subs for Pacific Channel. Cannot be done. Uh, Credit Savage. I swear these kids nowadays must not have heard about our crew that was around when SoFi dipped to the 13s. I swear, I loaded the boat during those days. During dips, bye, 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 Bargoon City. Coyote, um, Udemy is like an online lesson program. Uh, people can make education videos and course outlines with quizzes and tests that can certify they pass and understand the material popular in IT. Interesting. Delahote Spire, it's going higher. Uh, what's uh, 608 up 20 cents. Go Spire, go. ME twelve twelve up eighteen cents. Smart rent twelve ninety five up ninety two. Sextera up sixteen cents. Those are the winners in a down day today. Um, uh, is it worth at average down on my Sextera twelve and a half dollar calls for January? It looks like something might be cooking. Thirty bucks a contract right now, uh, so thirty cents each. Well, they're su they're super cheap, of course, but you're out of the money, and and that is the catch because even if the sh if the shares go up, uh, you know. Uh, a buck uh your contracts might go up a dime uh you're better off uh you know scoring ten dollar contracts and and grabbing those uh you're going to get much faster reaction to movement because uh, you're at 979 a share but if you can afford it I, I guess okay uh let's see yeah udemy is an online platform for people who teach courses for dollars i don't know how much their commission is but they have an ipo coming in a large following of students who take tons of 
courses. Sean and Wendy, uh, we took eight of the ten Uncle Bruce classes because we were on travel for two. They were great. Um, being in the live classes were the best. Uh, we do not do IPOs. Just asking about the company for education only. Right on, you guys. Michael, you should do a Bruce Occupies Wall Street meet and greet. There you go. <laughs> Rob, I got 15. Uh, AB, I got 15 of those calls. Uh, Tori, um, uh, that would be fun to have a huge conference with Uncle Bruce and Jen. Uh, I bet you'd get a turnout, a great turnout in attendance. We were thinking of something like in the LA area uh, to, do, to do our very first one. Uh, we're thinking somewhere near Ontario, California, the intersection of Highway 10, East and West, and 15, North and South. People can take expressways to come to that area. We maybe grab a hotel in that region there, grab a um, conference room, meeting room. Um, Put the date out there. Uh, let you all know it's happening. Offer tickets to come out so that you know you put some money down. You're coming because we gotta pay for the room. So you know you help us out, um, and then we'll know on the response just how big the room's gonna be. I mean, I'll talk to a hotel that can handle up to a certain number of people. I don't know how many, there, and uh, we might start with a room that can hold. 50 people or 100, and we might be able to expand that to 200 or to 300 or to 400. I don't know. I have no idea how many of you folks would show up. How many people are looking to see a balding old guy uh, that has a face for radio and his hot wife um, <coughs> to talk about the markets? I, I don't know. Uh, did you know Spire? It's uh, 617. It's going up. It's rocket. Spire is on fire. 617 right now is where it's at. Uh, the high today is 623, and it is on a roll. Question is, will it sustain that or go higher? I should have uh, I should have followed my gut and dumped hood yesterday. I didn't laugh out loud. Spire looks saucy. It looks saucy. Uh, Fred, uh, B, check, um, Fred B, check out the $6 spikes on Spire 2. No, the $6 strikes on Spire 2. Two. Sometimes it dips pretty hard, and you can scoop them for a great price. I got some last week around a dollar a piece. Download Spire's all good. Going for double digits. Joshua, there's a stock called IPOE. It's nine nine nine. Should I buy some shares? No. Uh, Michael, Spire uh, price hasn't moved much, but the contracts sure have. Interesting on Spire. There could be some real stuff going on. Uh, shenanigans going on again uh, on the upside this time. Keep your eye on this. Uh, hey, Bruce, what would be the biggest risk about buying and holding Spire stock for a while? Is it a dangerous move? It's not a dangerous move at all. Uh, pick up Spire, put it away, and enjoy the ride. Uh, I think the downside has been had. I, I really do. Um, Spire keeps releasing little nuggets of good info every week, says Erico. It's only a matter of time until the levy breaks and this sucker goes. Uh, do you think good third quarter earnings will be catalyst? Nope, I don't. I don't think the, the earnings will be the catalyst at all. No. I think continued government contracts will be the catalyst. And I believe there will be brokerage firms that have not covered it before that will start covering this company and will be putting out $15 and $20 target prices. That will be the catalyst. Uh, but right now, six seventeen dollars a share is where we're at. The Credit Savage, I suggest you pick up a Hilton business credit card. All-time high sign-up bonus, and you can uh, spend on it. Stay at the Hilton for free, 14 times uh, per dollar. Use the points at Waldorf Astoria for two nights. Well, thank you, Credit Savage, for that info. Uh, the Credit Savage Credit Coach. Uh, I loaded up not only on SoFi, but ME Spire ATIP. Bargain basement prices just waiting for them to pop. There you go. Spire's on fire. Uh, 617, up 28 cents. Uh, Cheryl, hey, Uncle B, what do you think about writing puts? On SoFi, yes, buying uh, cash covered puts on SoFi, great move. Yes, indeed. Uh, Rocket Labs, SoFi, uh, GameStop, uh, Matterport on ME, Spire, if you can get premiums. Uh, yes, uh, Smart Rent, can you do covered co cash secured puts? Yes, all of those. Yes, I really have a good feeling about Spire. Like, I really like this. Uh, this current price is wild to me. Get it while it's hot or cold. Uh, like I said, uh, we're sh we're showing little, we're seeing little signs of what I think is the future. A little breakout spikes are coming now. Just a little, pew, pew, uh, for some, you know, out of nowhere, a bunch of buying comes in on the stock and it just gets gobbled up. One point eight nine million today. That's double normal average. 
again, there's buying coming into the stock and it is about to break. I I'm just got the gut feeling there's a, a huge short position that's going to get caught with their pants down. And I think the buying is going to overwhelm the, the sellers and they're going to have to turn around and start buying up the stock to get out of their short positions. And they're going to run this thing and it's going to go. I just I just think that's what's happening. Uh, what gapped it down? Wish I could tell you. A nice call drop. Everyone, thanks everyone for giving me some of the advice here. You've got it, friend. I have no one to take care of my animals. Nobody. I need help. I want to buy SoFi call option. Which ones should I buy? buy on on sofa anybody want to tell them what to do bruce you missed out homeless uh you missed out uh homeless um bruce sofa is going the wrong way i guess it's time to load up on more cheap call options for next year well that might well be the case uh like i say it's uh, it's 1922 and uh it's uh what i can i tell you it's it's on sale um, bruce, could you do a poll in the community tab on your channel to gauge interest in a meetup uh yeah i will be doing something like that uh Kareem, there's stuff coming. Uh, false. Swire's teasing us. Um, come on, beef, beef, uh, beef cheeks. Make a move. Uh, Tori, uh, question. What is the reason behind having two plus tickers for a given stock? I've been wondering about this. I have CYXT and CYXTW. I think the the W are the warrants. Uh, those are the warrants, and CYXT are the shares, and they trade separately. Some of you have one. Some of you have both. Cheddar. I bought and sold Hood calls yesterday. That expire Friday. You knew their earnings were going to be trash. <laughs> it was well talked about. Wow. Vanderbilt, Nick, I just took advantage of the SoFi dip to buy 10 contracts of SoFi, 18 bucks for November for a buck 50. That's close. Uh, I wouldn't recommend uh, that, but uh, to, to those who know what they're doing and have a real handle on top of this market, you just go with what you like. 618 on Spire uh, moving up again um, a little bit higher. We're still five cents from the high of the day, but we are inching towards it. 1.9 million volume as we come into the last 29 minutes of the day. Ryan, start the fire, go Spire. Uh, the warrant story, yes, Mike, uh, they gave you one warrant for every three shares around that, depending on when you bought the stock. I already had 10 SoFi 18 at same expiration, so pretty much double down to lower the average cost. Nice move. Sean, go Spire, go Spire. Thanks, Uncle B and Auntie Jen. We have a ton. Bought another 100 for under six today. We listen well. There you go. There you go. Uncle Bruce, can you please take a look at... Uh, the Shiba something coin market volume. Do you think it can go to 100? Only way to look at chart. Everyone talks about kill, uh, killing X zero and everything. I don't know what this is. Uh, if it has to do with crypto, I don't want to know what this is. I'm not a crypto guy. I'm not, you know, I, I know of it. I'm aware of it, but I don't follow it. I don't know anything about this stuff. I have no time to look at stuff that I'm not familiar and comfortable with. Uh, I just I just can't. You know, I just can't help you there. Uh, it's not my shtick. Um, uh, you made me laugh on the Bruce Spire uh, transaction burns more coin. Fred, hey Bruce, what does a short seller look for in doing a st during stock transfer? Oh, too much. I have no time tonight for that. Feel that both Spire and ATP. I feel it. Uh, Spire would have left to leave the crap. It gets me against smaller amounts. There go. Buy a $25 put against SoFi for late 2023. Buy it back for a fraction when it runs. There's that. Excuse me, sell the put. Sorry about that. Um, Erico, you mean right, not by correct, correct. Uh, right, which is sell. Uh, SoFi has been the inverse of the VIX for a bit now. Hey, Brucey, um, my local council is insisting I exercise to reduce my fat arse's gravitational pull of other nebulae. But according to Stephen Hawking, this might cause a black hole implosion. What are your thoughts? Um, let me get back to you on that, Mr. T. Aspire uh, a little bit higher. He <laughs> he. Um, Nick, I'm looking at SoFi 20s. For March 18 uh, and April 14. Uh, that's what I'm looking for. Tori, thanks, Uncle Bruce and Michael, for the warrants information. Erico, you get me, man. Uh, yeah, I don't like it, too. It's the key. It goes more and more crazy. Uh, like I say, Gary, I make money on Doge back. I made money on Doge, uh, Jennifer, but I would never touch that again with a 10 foot pole. Uh, yeah, don't bother with it. Um, taking profit for now on whatever that is. Um, yeah, I just don't care. Rocket Lab down 35 cents, unfortunately, to 1287. I had a good day yesterday, a bad day today. SoFi down 74 cents to 1922, a bargoon in the making. GameStop down 499, bargoon. Uh, Matterport down 40 cents at 1856. It's coming back a bit, but not enough. ME 1215 up 21 cents. 
hanging around the higher end of the day. Spire, 614, uh, trying to uh, have a good day. The Dow is not helping, but we're doing what we can. ATIP down 13 cents. Smart rent up 86 cents to 12.89. Volume on smart rent after Goldman Sachs recommended it as an $18 target price. Volume, 346,000 shares. That's all it is. This is not even started yet. The smart rent has not even begun to run. Not even begun to run. It will. There are options out there. You may want to look at 1250s. You may want to look at, uh, I don't know if you can get 13s or 14s or 50s. I'm not sure of the breakdown. Check out smart rent options. Go into next year. Um, Sextera, 983, up 20 cents. Hanging around here. Uh, high of the day, 987. Volume, 179,000 shares. No one is saying a word. Something's going on. I don't know what it is, but the stock is inching, inching, and inching higher. Something's cooking, but I can't tell you what's cooking. I don't know. Um, the all-time high on this one, 12 bucks. Uh, that's the all-time high on Sex Terra. AMC down, down a buck 28. Robinhood down 431 to 35.26. Uh, Vanek down 92 cents. Home Depot up four bucks. IBM down a buck 85. The Dow down 191. S&P down 11. NASDAQ up 45 points. Microsoft holding a $14 gain to $324. Apple down 24 cents. Earnings coming up soon. Tesla down 19 or up $19. Bed Bath Beyond down 48. Blackberry down 20. Royal Caribbean down 67 cents to 83.75. Low of the day today, 83.68. The stock is under pressure. This is the last month on Royal Caribbean. Look at that chart. Down, 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 down. Uh, it's going lower. Um, that's my gut on it. Um, but what can I tell you? It has to. Uh, you know, here's today's chart. I mean, it's just falling out of the ta off the table at the end of the day there. Look at that. Zzz, right down there. Uh, Royal Caribbean. I've been calling it 50, 60 bucks stock for I don't know how many months. Um, finally backing off. Anyway, it's defied gravity for too long. Goldman down 641 to 411, getting into a, some deals there. Amazon up 28. Facebook down $2. Google up 153.96. Uh, Target down 147, JP Morgan down 330, Costco up 534, Cisco up 60 cents, 5642, looking good on Cisco, pushing uh, pushing the $60 level again uh, pretty soon the way it's going. Most interesting day here, Aspire now 618 a share, um, up 29 cents. The high trade on, on Spire today, 623. We're a nickel away from the high of the day on Spire with the Dow down 176. Uh, volume is uh, pushing 2 million shares now on Spire. 618 a share on 1.93 million shares traded, double average, at least double the norm. Very interesting. Uh, this stock was 540 for the low, I believe it was. Yeah, 540 a couple of days ago. It touched it. Uh, did a lot of trading between 550 and six bucks. A lot of trading in there, uh, but it, it seemed to stop dropping. It just it just there was too much buying uh, to support it. Now there's buying on the other direction. It's now 619. Went another penny just now. We're up 30 cents. And uh, the high of the day is 623. We may well break that. We'll see just if there's an attack on this stock by the short sellers. Who's going to try to keep it down? Could it break out? Yes. If it were to break out, how far and how fast is the question? Uh, is this a breakout that's going to happen in the aftermarket, in a pre-market scenario? Would we wake up tomorrow, start trading tomorrow at 850 a share? I don't know. Uh, anything is possible on this stock it can break out at any time 621 right now just jumped a couple of pennies it's two cents from the high of the day of 623 very very uh, entertaining and interesting and uh full of wonderment to say the least i'm really curious uh let's see what's going on um adam bruce you were correct i wrote some covered calls on sofi nothing changed with my position but i did make 20 bucks in premiums very cool um uh, hi bruce 14 dollar puts uh february 18 expiry for nine dollars on spire what are your thoughts on that uh, uh 14 dollar put on spire uh, getting nine bucks, uh, so you'll bring in nine, which means you're paying five to get the stock. If you had to buy it at 14, you would actually pay 
not five for it until February. So you're getting a dollar nineteen premium on it. Uh, you're not getting rich, but you know what? You're putting up fourteen hundred to get nine hundred back. You're into a five hundred dollar deal. Uh, you can make money doing that. Obviously, the stock goes to ten dollars a share. As an example, it just goes to ten. This put's only worth four dollars. You get to keep five bucks, uh, assuming that that is between now and February, without any time premium left on the contract. Yes, indeed. Um, something to look at. So far, Semper Fi. Um, credit uh, Savage. Uh, well, So far is taking a breather. So what did I do? What do I do? Uh, I bought ten. $25 January 22 contracts for 95 cents each. Guess I'll just have to make money when it rips because of the bank charter and the third quarter earnings. There you go. Um, the Credit Savage. Uh, I'm sitting on some of those calls also. Exciting times, says Coyote. Cheddar, I've been, uh, I, with that said, I made a boatload of money flipping Doge in the big run up. I had it for uh, five, whatever. Um, whatever. Coyote, if SoFi announces the charter, then earnings growth and then Super Bowl, SoFi saying, oh me, oh my. There's a lot of hype coming. A ton of exposure for SoFi to come yet. 621 right now on Spire Global. Um, sitting up 32 cents right now. High of the day, 623. Uh, about uh, 145 today is when we did that. We have 20 minutes left to go and we're right near the high of the day on Spire. The question is, will we hold it or will we lose it? ME up 32 cents as well. Uh, 1226, the high today, 1228. It's near its high. 3.17 million traded on ME. So ME and Spire are both having a wonderful time. They're both up 32 odd cents each right now uh, near their highs of the day. All righty. Oh, what else is going on here? Um, ME is slowly creeping up from the low of the day. 172.33, says uh, Fenville. Fantastic. Uh, down still 418 or 420. Uh, got turkey on the smoker. Going to pig out soon. Oh, wow. Oh, man. Uh, what can we say? Uh, what else is going on here? Um, if the spire volume stays at one to two million per day, I don't think the shorters can keep this below 750 until November 19. I, I don't think they're going to be able to do it. I, I, I agree. I think that kind of volume will just eat them alive, and uh, the shares will uh, will go up 40, 50 cents a day every day. And uh, 10 days from now, we're at uh, 12 bucks, and uh, three weeks from now, we're at uh, 16. We're just going to go. It's just, just going to go. Uh, come on, Spire. Seven, eight bucks by Friday. Let's go. Uncle Bruce at the meet and greet. Can we rewatch the old streams from January 27, 28, back when you used to talk to us all day long? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, man. Those are crazy days. I got to admit, though, that was wild. That was, I had no idea that I'd have to do that. No idea that, that the stock would do what it did. It was just nuts, crazy, crazy times. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a meet and greet. I'm gonna have you all in a room. I'm gonna lock the room. No one can get out. Uh, and then we're gonna keep you in for eight straight hours to see who has to pee the most. <laughs> well, I'll be just relaxed, you know. And in about an hour or two, people get uncomfortable. About four hours in, people are kind of cramping up. And then uh, six hours, we're gonna be holding themselves. Oh, we're gonna have a pool. Who's peeing their pants? Who isn't? The bets are going to be flying along with everything else. Oh, that's going to be some fun. And the smell. Oh, the smell. Robert, um, six tear is also slowly moving upwards. Did you notice that, Bruce? Six tear. Did you see that? Uh, 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 982 up 19 cents. Love it. Love it. Smart rent 1290 up 88 cents. That's having a great day today. Bruce, uh, regarding the Spire options, last time you noticed suspicious activity, which could lead to a squeeze. Do you see this kind of activity? On 1119 options, I'm not in for a squeeze. Just curious. Um, I, I haven't, I haven't had time to, to watch. I, I'm too busy, just literally calling the market as I see it. We're at 623 on Spire. The high of the day, right now, has been hit again. We're back to the high of the day of 623, 624 right now. We just broke the high of the day here. Um, I have no idea about the options uh, activity at the moment for today. 1.99 million volume. We're breaking 2 million. We got 17 minutes to go. Uh, 6.24 on Spire. 6.27 on Spire. We just jumped again. Uh, the resistance is gone, and it's going higher. Uh, the Fenville, uh, Fen thanks for about 20 November, 5.18 strike. Hope we make moolah. Um, good old days, meet and pee puts. <laughs> 
DP myself. Um, the only refreshments in the conference room is lock in is Taco Bell buffet. Uh, Six twenty seven exactly. Six twenty seven. Uh, peeing your pants is cool. Consider me Miles Davis. I picked up two more six Terra January calls. Uh, Twelve and a half for thirty cents. Uh, thirty dollars so thirty cents each. This is some unusual objectivity going on. One hundred six moved today. Usually been like five to zero to ten a day. I have an even ten now. We will see what's going on. O'Doyle rules up. Sean, Uncle Bruce, and Eddie Jen Spire is on fire. Uncle Bruce is a much younger man. Uh, ten months ago, he's older now. Uh, no, all day, don't do it. Andy Jen is still young. Don't do it. Six twenty one, six twenty three. We're jumping around here. Oscar says, "Let's go to seven. A Wally's world on that locked in the room for eight hours. Comment diapers, Uncle Bruce. Diapers still with you." <laughs> You had me at Taco Bell Buffet. Uh, you had me there. Uh, I'm in a 623 on Spire now. Volume 2,018,000. Um, watching the Spire. Smart Rent, 1289 up 86 cents. Volume on Spire, 359,000. Uh, 23 and me, 1229. High of the day was 1232. We're right there. 3.23 million. The ME. Uh, Spire and Smart Rent are the winners today. Uh, those are the three winning for us today. What can I say? SoFi a little better. Uh, back to 1930 after dropping it to, to 1914. We're now 1930 on SoFi down 66. A tiny bit of a recovery. I'm not getting excited. 15.69 million on SoFi traded. Uh, Rocket Lab uh, down 33 cents. The low today was 12.73. That was this morning. It's now 12.89 down 33 cents. GameStop still down 402 to 173.80. Matterport 1850 down 44. Uh, ME now 1232. That's the high of the day on ME. We're pushing the high of the day around on 3.24 million with the 14 minutes to go. It's coming on. Aspire 623, the high of the day 627 on 2 million plus shares. ATIP still down 13 cents. Smart Rent 12.90 up 87 cents. And Sextera up 19 cents. Kind of just hanging around. Uh, 9.82 last trade up 19 cents. Uh, that's the dealio. The Dow down 193. No help there. We've got uh, S&P down 11, and we have Nasdaq up 48.8. That is where we're at right now on this market. Um, I think ME and Smart Rent are winners today. ME showing strength, and Smart Rent got that. Goldman Sachs price target. Heads up, people. ATIP at a total bargoon. Uh, I wonder how much volume we're needing on Spire to break out of the clutches of the shorts. Um, let's see if Spire pushes through 630. Seems like that point of resistance. Uh, again, I will add Spire at 642. Get it there. Let's see what happens. Spire at 632 now, up 43 cents. Spire, high of the day, 633 now. Uh, really moving, and it's a trade at two million eighty-two thousand. Buying is coming in on the stock at the end of the day. Thirteen minutes to go, six thirty-one. We got the high of the day going here up to six thirty-three. Very good. Me twelve thirty-four. Uh, that's the high of the day as well. Twelve thirty-five, twelve thirty-four, three point two five million. Both moving. Uh, Me up forty cents. Spire up forty-two. They're both having a wonderful time here. Look in good. Uh, do you think Robinhood's earnings are dragging down SoFi as a sympathy move? Nope, I don't think so. Spire pop, people are saying. Uh, Spire still at 933, 1933 at the moment. Spire, let's go, baby. Uh, 632. Uh, 642 stacks. It was 642 yesterday. Right now, Spire, 628. Uh, ME, 1234. Smart Rent, 1290. Smart Rent coming back on a bit again as well. Interesting. Uh Seems like Spire moves up with the same amount uh, with ME. Which ones do you prefer? Uh, there you go. Of course, uh, Spire moves up a penny. ME moves up a penny. The percentage is greater for for Spire because it's a six thirty stock versus a twelve dollar stock. Double the double the percentage impact, but still, they're both moving here. Six thirty on Spire, twelve thirty six on ME. Uh, we're down two hundred eight on the Dow. No help on the big board. At all, it is completely negative over there. Uh, we're down to 12 minutes to go in the day, as we're watching to see what is going to happen. Uh, they say that the uh, Nasdaq is one within one percent of its all-time record high. It has a 40-point gain today. 
Uh, so it's 150 points away from an all-time record high for the NASDAQ. S uh, S S&P and Dow yesterday with their, with their gains yesterday both set record highs yesterday. They're not going to do that today, obviously. Uh, let's see, um, 600, 11, 19 contracts at 750 purchased in like the last five minutes on Spire. There is serious option activity happening on Spire right now. Fenville, I'm a Spire boy myself. 647 yesterday says Delahode. I'm happy I bought and I, I bought and bought Spire. I really like the company, says Robert Benz. There you go, 630 on Spire, 1235 on ME, 1237 on ME, that's a new high, 3.2 trade at 3.2 million on 43 cent gain on ME now, high of the day, Spire 628 up 39 cents, Smart Rent 1288 up 85 cents, uh, Secretary 982 up 18 cents right here. SoFi 1930 down 65 cents, low of the day 914, so a 16 cent recovery. Not a lot to get excited about. Rocket Lab 1273 low, trading at 1288, still down 34 cents. Lots going on. I am on both Emmy Inspired to Double Whammy here. Uh, James, uh, I watched a video yesterday about a SoFi reporting error. It showed that SoFi's biggest investor, SoftBank, sold all their shares when they didn't. That's correct. That is not true. Yeah, it touched on the trade. It didn't close the trade block that high. So Got to go. Have a great night. Thank you, Sharon. You take care. James, uh, yeah, I remember Uncle Bruce talking about it when it happened. Uh, that is it there. Um, whatever. Ten minutes to go in the day. ME1237, Spire 635, new high on your Spire 635 has been touched uh, already, uh, looking good. ME1234, Spire 632, 1287 on Smart Rent. We got, we got some stocks going up here, definitely uh, holding 18 cents on Sextera. The Dow down 222, unfortunately, low of the day. S&P down 16. Nasdaq down is still up 27 points, but it's dropping. It's coming back. We're down 248 on oil, 82.17 on oil today. Interest are lower. Uh, the 10-year note down in the low 150s uh, was it 160, 162, 163 last week, or roughly it's now back to the 152 range. Interesting stuff. Um, consecutive good days on Spire. This feels good, Uncle Bruce. Um, it's looking very good. Uh, we, we like the look of this. Uh, Spire, 624 right now. little selling wave coming in. We're going to watch this. 628. Emmy, 1232. Uh, Nick, you are just too generous, man. You're awesome. Thank you so much for that donation. Um, I'm glad to see you made nice money today. <laughs> Uh, way to go on those uh, on those GameStop options. <laughs> you did really well selling ten at four ninety five and picking them back up around what was one sixty something like that. I love that. Uh, that was a beautiful trade today. Uh, more to come. More to come. Uh, thank you everybody so much for all your support. Uh, no matter whether it's a super chat or it's a PayPal donation, becoming a member of this channel. Uh, Jen and I do appreciate all of it. Thank you so much. Keeps us alive. Keeps us going. Sextair up, up 18. Smart Rent up 82 cents to 12.85. ATIP 271 down 16 cents. Spire at 631 up 42 cents. 634 up 45 cents. And ME 12.35 down up 41 cents. We have eight minutes to go here. We're coming in. To the end of the day, uh, watching this market, uh, never a dull moment. ME, 1235, Spire, 6, uh, 629, and um, a Smart Run, 1286, Sextera, 982. Uh, man, this is awesome. Uh, sharing profits with your awesome real-time help. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Uh, Joshua, Uncle Bruce, I have an ME, 1750-21 January call I bought that I'm almost back to even on. Should I roll that into something else or just hold it? You got a January ME. You got plenty of time. Just stick, stick around and uh, just let that market uh, go from here. Um, and uh, I sold my Telus, Tesla stock and I got 370 more ATIP. I think we're going to do well. There you go, Nathan. Care, uh, come on, ME. Let's hit 1250. Uh, Vanderbilt, Nick. Way to go. Cheers, Eric. Oh, these success stories trades even make me uh, happy to see. Make me happy to see. Uh, it must feel like watching your child walk for the first time, Bruce. Uh, Daniel, now another 1400 volume on uh, $9 contracts for Spire. Looks like folks are piling in 
to the calls on Spire. They're they're picking it off. They're getting the sense that the Spire breakout is happening, and they want in on these options now. Uh, very interesting. Very interesting to see uh, how this is playing out. ME twelve thirty five of forty one cents now. Uh, the high today twelve thirty nine three point three four million shares on ME. Uh, Spire six twenty one up thirty two cents. Uh, Smart Rent uh, twelve eighty five up eighty two cents and Sextera up eighteen cents. We're just waiting for ATIP to join the party. Uh, bring a new CEO on board and let's get this thing going. Let's get this ATIP to six bucks and then get it to eight and then get it to 10 and oh will the viewers of this channel be richer oh my god will they be richer uh the iv on those options is over 200 percent good lord yep cheddar you're noticing you're noticing how those uh, sh those contracts are running unbelievable the spire uh is getting hit right now at 620 are you surprised you shouldn't be uh the shorters are going to try to crash this market they're going to try to keep that stock uh, from looking too good but it, it's not working 619 is is the price still up 30 cents uh the volume you can't hide the volume uh, 2.4 million now traded uh spire could go a lot higher than this um the battle is on with spire 1240 on me new high on ME, we're up 46 cents on your on your 23andMe stock. Again, $12.40. We have four minutes to go. 3.36 million going higher. Your options are going nicely higher. You gotta love this. Um, Spire 619 right now. The battle is on. It is a royale battle here. Uh, watching this closely, to say the least. Rocket Lab still 1284 down 39 cents. SoFi 1928 down 67. GameStop down 415. Matterport down 61 cents. ME 1242 new high of 1244 here just been touched. 3.4 million looks like now on ME. Spire 620 battling along here. Um, and 1284 on Smart Rent 980 on Sextera. Whew, what a war. I need to learn about put options and covered puts. Uh, we'll do so after market closes. Any suggestion where I get more info on it to learn, Nick? Watch my classes. <laughs> you got to watch the lessons, Nick. Uh, I sold covered calls earlier today for Spire. Oh, well, can't get max profit on all covered calls. Uh, sold covered calls on Spire. Uh, yeah, well, you're betting against the crowd, man. I don't know. Dory, I have... Um, M M A T. Uh, do you know what the other letter stands for? M M T L P. Something limited partnership. I have no idea. Uh, I do not understand how a company can mistakenly say a business sold one billion in SoFi and then just say, "Oops, my bad." It's infuriating. I hear you. Uh, I'm in for ATIP. I bought another two hundred here. Holy moly! Those ten Spire ten dollar calls. Remember, I bought for a hundred. Uh, up to three twenty profit now. It's here's money coming into that market. Look out. Uh, S and P sell off a uh, little one, anyways. James sitting on a thousand shares and twenty five seven fifty calls for Spire. Uh, just tell you that I'm not sold on that narrative. Uh, so what should we buy, uh, Robert? I have to go. Thanks, Bruce, for the work once again today. Are putting in all day after day. See you all tomorrow. Thank you, Robert. Uh, Spire six nineteen up thirty. M E twelve forty six now. That's the uh, pushing the high of the day again. 3.45 million last two minutes. Uh, we're coming on here on these two stocks. Uh, 12.46 on ME up 52 cents. Spire up 30 to 6.19. Smart Rent up to 12.83 up 80 cents with that big buy recommendation from Goldman Sachs. Sextera 9.80 up 17 cents. We are still down 2.43 on the Dow, the low of the day. S&P down 20, almost 21 points. And Nasdaq only up seven points. As it's given up the gains, oil uh, down 247 to 8218. Um, but the war is between ME, Spire, Smart Rent, and Sextera. These stocks are all um, pushing up higher today in a lousy market. 1248 on ME, high of the day right now with two minutes to go. 1248 on 23 and me a real strong close 619 on spire volume now 2.48 million at 619 620 we've got uh, smart rent 1283 up 80 and six up 16 to 979 
look at the close on ME. It is still looking good. Looking great on Spire. What the heck was so funny? Your voice is really soothing. I watch your old videos and I have nothing to do. Um, and uh, yeah, there you go. What can I say? Uh, we've down 253 on the Dow. we got a minute left to go. Uh, 53 seconds exactly, according to CNBC. We're coming into the close. Spire, the battle is on at 617, 619. ME, 1246 right now. Uh, Smart rent up 82, Sixter up 16 cents, Matterport down 59, GameStop down 423, SoFi down 75 cents to 1921, Bargoon there, Rocket Lab down 37 cents to 1285. That is the market as we're coming into the bell uh, very shortly. Larry's going to hit the bell any minute. Show so much fun right now. Oh my gosh, it is something. 620 on Spire, a real battle going on here at the end of the day on Spire, a real battle. Uh, 2.5 million traded, 100,000 every couple of minutes going through on Spire. 1242 on ME, 619 Spire, 617 Spire, jumping all over. We are getting ready. They're clapping their hands, I bet you, right now. Here it is. Woohoo! They're clapping their hands on the Dow. The Dow is done for the day, and that means... Look at what Larry does. The bells are ringing. As far as, as Larry is hitting the bells, it's over. It's over. We're done for the day. Oh, my gosh. What a run. Um, let's see. What else is going on? Um, AB says, Lobo Blast. Uh, I yoloed 100 in the Spire. $10 November calls when it was 8 to $0.10 cents for a gamble. That'll moon again before the 19th. It's now 53 cents. Nicely done. <laughs> making 400 bucks that's all right uh all kinds of other stocks are down five percent or so at the same time a ton of them i think it's just uh, bs not buying it um let's see here less than two weeks ago i was averaging down on me uh two bucks a share now i'll be averaging up 350 or more a share laughing out loud uh jack ding 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 the bells uh my webell app keeps saying there's a network connection problem anyone else experiencing everything else on my phone is running fine Mike, uh, 1620 close. Uh, not sure what stock he's referring to. Uh, oops, I was looking into the future, meant 620 close. <laughs> Spire, 620, soon to be 1620. How about that? Uh, can we look at the chart on ME? Do we see the strength in that close? Uh, 1240, last trade. Uh, the high today, 1248. Um, the day, this is the day's trade on ME. Two steps up, one step down. Two steps up, one step down. Two steps up, one step down. All day, all day, all day, all day. Look at that. Two up, one down. Two up, one down. Two up, one down. Two up, one down on ME. That is serious up move on ME. Uh, look at the week on ME. Look at that. And take a look at the month now for ME. Look at when that stock got mentioned. It was down in that uh, seven-something range on the 12th there. Look at this. That is a shot, people. That is a 50% plus gain on ME, and it's still going higher. Spire, 620. Um, here's the month. Uh, look at where we have to go. We were way up there at 15. Look at where we are now. We're nowhere yet. We haven't even begun to recover this thing. The last week looks good. Uh, sure, yeah, it came back up here. But uh, we are nowhere near recovered on Spire yet. We have got so much to recover. There's a $10 bill waiting on that stock, and it is owed to us. We demand it. Let's see what happens with this. So what a day on Spire says Galvin. Uh, that's a good looking day chart. Uh, short is really trying to keep this down. Uh, they're not going to, it's not going to work. Uh, this, the word is spreading. It's beginning to spread. I bet you the Reddit crowd is talking about it a lot, and I bet you they're going to be all over this thing. Uh, and soon we may have the possibility, it's possible. There could be hundreds of thousands of speculators, day traders, uh, just just folks who are looking for a good time, coming in to pick off Spire, and they're going to buy it up to nine, ten bucks. They're just going to buy it all up, and they're going to offer it at fourteen to sixteen to eighteen to twenty bucks, and they're going to sell it right back to the shorters who are desperate to cover their butts. Could be a lot of fun. We'll see. Um, we don't know. And me looking real juicy. Uh, Globe and Mail article about increased short activity in uh, stocks uh, like uh, CP Railway, Air Canada, Lightspeed. I think we might see some retail rallies against these short hedges. You never know. Um, when you see two up, one down steps like on ME, does that mean the heavy hitters are trying to sub sub subtly gobble it up so they don't go nuclear? 
possible. Um, there's acquisition going on. There's just a lot of acquiring of stock going on. And they buy for a bit, then they hold off and let it come in, and then they buy it up, and then they back off. It's, it's a strategy to acquire, to accumulate, 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 accumulate. It's a good strategy. Uh, we did trade today 3.5 million shares in total. And maybe somebody bought a million and a half, two million today. I don't know. Uh, ME green candlestick into the close with decent volume compared to its normal volume. Yeah, that's looking good. My ME April 750s are up 145%. We're going higher. And yes, you are. And you're not in the money yet. Uh, you're not in, well, ME, I should say. You're in the money. I Pardon me. You're in the money. I was just thinking about Spire. 750 Spires aren't in the money. They're moving up too. That's SoFi and SoFi Bank Sheet. Uh, is uh, a BS uh, telling you all. I'm just telling you, uh, we get, uh, we, what is it? We to get Uncle Bruce more likes so we can afford the infrastructure to pull up charts on the screen. Uh, in any event, it doesn't matter. Uh, buy more if you're mad. Oh, so far, my love, you're killing me. ATAP is still dropping in the after hours. New low, dang. Uh, okay, okay. I need to jump into some covered calls on ME. I have 600 shares lying around. Uh, Spire just got clapped. Uh, yep, AB, what Bruce said is exactly right. Made 500 on some GameStop covered calls today, says Daniel. Uh, for everyone who does this, beware of 11.24 futures roll. GameStop runs hard on that day. See, to say February 24th, May 24th, August 24th, check out uh, November 24th. You don't want to get bet against the stock on those dates. Interesting. Most of the time, sellers will do the same thing when they are looking to offload a ton of stock, especially insiders. They don't want to ruin the market. Adam went down to 6 bucks, had a limit, so I picked up some shares. AB, if Spire hits 15 by November, that's a $5,000 profit on a $100 investment for me. Uh, that's got to be Wall Street bets worthy of a brag, don't you think? Uh, not bad at all. Um, aftermarket on Spire, 6 bucks right now, down $0.20. Cents. That is true. It is showing down $0.20 cents on a volume of, what, 400 shares? So that's a that's a bunk quote. It's a, it's a nothing burger quote. It's not going to sit there. It's not real. It's just a uh, probably even a typo. I wouldn't get all worried about it. Hit squad on Spire, literally trying to put this on the $6 lower. Aspire, Unreal, one of y'all just sold 300 shares. Jeez, unbelievable. Um, yeah, I'd be buying this stuff. I'd be putting in 601 bids like crazy and trying to score this stuff, uh, steal it. It's being handed over. If this is truly available, I'd buy it. Uh, but anyway, that's just me. That just makes me like it more, says Michael. There you have it. Um, interesting, interesting day, to say the least here. ME, 1240 last trade, 1241 and 1249 aftermarket trades is what I've been showing or noticing lately. Uh, Rocket Lab at 1284, still the same price in the aftermarket. Uh, SoFi 1925, same price on the aftermarket. GameStop 173.60, uh, up 20 cents on the aftermarket. Matterport 1836, same price on the aftermarket. Nothing much to get excited about at the moment. ATIP uh, 270, up a half a penny on the aftermarket. Smart Rent 1274, the at the end of the day 1288 aftermarket, up 14 cents. On the aftermarket, S6 Stara, two, 979 was the last trade on the uh, market. No trades on the aftermarket at the moment. 215,000 traded on the day on Sextera, up 16 cents, the quiet one. Uh, very quiet. Uh, interesting. Internet and power issues all day in Boston, a big nor'easter. Uh, AB, only worth a brag if you have 100 to your name. Uh, Hello, Smith, Uncle Bruce. How you doing, Hello, Smith? Uh, Michael, Joe, we got that all day yesterday in New York. Uh, Nicholas, uh, that's a scratch-off ticket winner at that point. Hello, Uncle Bruce, I bought up a ton of Spire stock. When it does a run-up, should I sell at the top or just write covered calls? Uh, when it pops, you write covered calls. Yes, start writing covered calls when it pops up there. Absolutely, yeah. Take advantage of that gift that is being handed to you on a silver platero. Unbelievable. Ron, thank you, Ron, so much for that donation on uh, PayPal. Uh, that uh, That is a gold medal donation today. That matches our top donation of the day. Thank you very, very much. The PayPal donations are the most preferred uh, for this channel because uh, uh, Jen and I get about 90 six percent of that roughly after the banking fees and transfer fees uh and it's instantaneously available um paypal uh super chats which we love uh they uh, the youtube people take 30 percent off the top we only get 70 percent 
and it can take up to six weeks to get paid because we only get paid once a month from YouTube. These PayPal's are instantaneous and we, we get a majority of that cash comes to us. So thank you very, very much. All of you out there supporting this channel, you guys are awesome, man. Keeping us going. Uh, without you, we would not be here. I never got into GameStop and AMC, but your options education opened up other income stream for me. I played the Google and Microsoft options, and what a great hit. Thanks, Uncle B. Ron. I'm happy. Uh, like I said, there's so much potential for you. Uh, you can really do well, and uh, you can do uh, poor man covered calls as well on, on high-end stock. There's so many ways to make money on make make money writing call options there are so much and uh, ron keep it going man just keep it going and i'm just thrilled that it's working for you i'm so happy uh nicholas is laughing tori i found that uh mmtlp means torchlight placeholder i have actual shares in the company is what i understand evan a uh, thumbs up for bruce a uh, credit savage aspire january 23 they have uh, 31 20 dollar contracts with an ask of $940. Is this a synth synthetic pump, Uncle Bruce? I, I don't know what to make of that. Spire, um, $20 contracts. January 23rd, Spire. Uh, that, that Yeah, I, I don't understand. That That is a market that may not be real. That might be a misprint. I don't know what to make of it, Credit Savage. I really don't know what to make of it. A, B, are, are there professional brokers, traders that just try to hunt down and flip options on mini squeezes? Like the whole industry of data crunchers, not people yoling? Like, yeah, there are. Uh, there are computer software programs always looking for deals, always hunting for, for trade opportunities. There are computer programs that will trade uh, contracts on stuff like SPY, the, the S&P 500 index. For, for two pennies a contract. Like they will, they'll get in and out of thousands of contracts for pennies, in and out, in and out, in and out, in and out. Same with the stock. They'll flip stock like Apple stock for a penny or two or three pennies a share, thousands of shares at a time, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. Always being done, always. Uh, Lobo Blast, Ron Williams. I got into GameStop and AMC back when I found Uncle Bruce. Uncle Bruce mentioned right covered call back in April. I rolled my profits into SoFi, ME, and Spire. There you go. Uh, that's some money laundering, says Goyote. Well, you know, that's uh, open trading. It's allowed to be done. Uh, Chris Evans, I'm looking at Spire, and it looks like there's asks of 960 and 460 and so on at different prices during January 2023. Uh, Michael, yes, but none are filled None are filled credit. Anyone can put in an ask, but it doesn't mean it'll fill. That's true. You can put an offer in, but if you get hit, you, you may not get hit. It just looks good, but you don't get it. Maybe you should look up Black Pools. Uh, there you go. There's Black you want to know where money changes hands, go to London and check out the uh, derivatives. Unbelievable trading going on in London. Yeah. Oh, boy. And read up on the book Flash Boys. Oh, my gosh. Uh, let's see. Spire, it's now showing 602 on 400 shares. I, I, I'm not sure to believe this quote. It, this is so – it's now 619. So, you know, there's no change here. It, it, it's, it's, it's all just all over the place. Um, let's see here. Those Spire November options move thousands of units. Looks like they're trying to play it the other way up now. Here we go. Uh, don't be surprised. Uh, get ready for a ride, guys. AB uh, today. Um, the other the other way today. Mm, interesting. It's going to be interesting, AB. Really entertaining, to say the least. Uh, we're going to watch this closely, of course, uh, to help you all over this one. Uh, just unbelievable. Smart Rent 1274 was the last trade on the market. 1288 aftermarket right now. 14 cents on Smart Rent. Uh, ME 1240 last trade. 1244 aftermarket. So we're still looking good on the aftermarket as well. Interesting stuff. Uh, wow. Uh, Unreal. Uh, it's been a heck of a day here today and a heck of a market. Guys, uh, I tell you, we are in for some fun tomorrow. I hope you're going to join me. Um, I'll be on the air uh, at 8.30, uh, one hour before the opening, keeping an eye on the pre-market and uh, doing my little rant in the morning. Uh, always welcome to join me for that. Thank you for those of you who made donations to us today. As always, you're the best. Uh, thank you keeping us alive. We appreciate it. Uh, thank you for becoming members and renewing your membership on this channel. All of you who are doing that, you guys are great. Any of you and all of you who are subscribing to this channel, I do appreciate it. Uh, if there's a way to let the world know we exist and get more people to do that, 
that grows the channel as well. We've had 225 thumbs ups for the afternoon show. I thank you for these 225 thumbs ups. If you're able to hit the thumbs up button before you close out your, your uh, communicator today, I'd appreciate it. That communication device you have from Star Trek days, uh, find the thumbs up button and hit it for us and give us a bit of momentum with YouTube. There we are, 230 now. The thumbs ups are creeping in here. Um, that would be really great. Hit the thumbs up button hard, 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 and help us get more momentum on YouTube. 241 now, just got 10, just like that. Thank you. 243 now, another couple thumbs ups. Thank you guys uh, for all this assistance. I'm going to throw up some uh, neat emojis in celebration of the fact that it looks like our Spire and our ME and our smart rent shares are on fire uh we are going to go higher with these stocks guys let's give some encouragement to our friends at sofi and let's hope that the, the neat emojis the power of the neat will make the stocks go higher neat 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 um there is no way you can stop the power of the neat emojis from making stocks go much higher in our portfolios thank you all so much 259 thumbs up they're coming in 259 thumbs ups they're coming in here and the neat emojis are following right behind with a whole bunch of you following in here 260 thumbs ups thank you guys for the support um i want to wish you a pleasant evening uh, i want to wish you uh the best of uh, uh of health have a great night uh and stay healthy for me join me tomorrow morning at 8 30 for, uh, for the first show and three o'clock tomorrow afternoon tomorrow being thursday looking forward to seeing you and again 266 thumbs ups thank you for those keep them coming on guys hit that thumbs up button thank you for these uh, donations today super chats and membership renewals thank you everybody for coming in here piling in to have some fun and making a couple of bucks that's all we're trying to do we're just trying to make a couple of bucks it's, it's it's an innocent channel we just want to get richer quicker that's all uh that's all we're working on have a good night everybody thank you Cody. Thank you, Credit Savas, Josh and Larry, Sean, uh, you guys, uh, Sean and Wendy, thank you. Mike, thanks, buddy. Michael Downs, thanks. Vernon, buddy. Shaky Fry Watt, thanks. Lobo Blast, thank you, guys. I'm going to patiently wait for your alert. Uncle Bruce, bye for now. You guys have a good night. Thanks for checking out those, those lessons for me. Credit Savage, uh, thanks, man. Della Ho, glad I'm on Spire 550. Yes, you are glad you did. Thanks, Uncle B. Thanks, JC. Joshua, thank you. John Gale, thanks, buddy. All of you guys, you're the best. Uh, the best YouTube has. You're right here. Thank you, guys. We'll see you tomorrow. Good night.